What happened at half time? I'm not too sure. Well, we had an awesome start. Um, our intensity was up. I think we just, you know, we didn't really come out at half time really well. And I think it was the little errors and Vixen just capitalised on it. And then it was just too hard to try and win it back. And yourself, you had a really great game today as well. Thank you. So what have you done to sort of help the, your help my game yeah yeah well I think just getting this week it's just been getting the confidence back in my own game and just making sure I have that connection so I'm really down packed with uh, Gretz and now Lenny and you know they give me the confidence out on court you know just let the ball into the circle which is awesome and was it the emotion of indigenous ground that may have helped a bit as well oh definitely I had so much fire in the belly and um just even just wearing this dress just kind of gave me a you know a little oomph and um just seeing like the little girls that have come down from all the remote communities just um you know just put that extra fire in the belly because you know we just wanted to play for them and your switch to wa what was the what was the reasoning for that one? i think just to change it up a little bit so we just made a few little mistakes and i guess to put ez out on court as well um to see what she could do get that um lift of intensity as well probably in the defense end yeah. um it may close next week yeah, definitely. So down in Melbourne again. Um, well, we drew with them in round two. So, you know, I think um, they had a loss yesterday. So I think we're both going to be quite vulnerable and hungry to win this game. So, yeah, bring it on. So what do you need to do to get that consistency through the whole court? Yeah, I think we're just going to look back. We're going to analyse our game. I think probably in the defence, I think we need to step up a bit quicker. Um, don't let the attackers get that short little connections um, and just try and win some more balls so we can get it back down to our shooters and score some more goals. Yes. She asked all my questions, but I do have one more. So obviously you're down in Melbourne next week and then there's the World Cup break. How, how excited are you about playing in the Heart Sapphire series? Yeah, pretty excited. I get to go back and play with my little sister in the Wildcats. Um, we're five years apart, so I've never get to, gotten to play netball with her. So it will be quite good to go back and play with my old team. And what's it going to look like? Well, what's the training schedule and the practice schedule while you're um, in the Sapphire Series? Yeah, so the first week um, is a bit of a rested week. We're not doing too much, still getting hitting up in the gym. And then we get to go train with our um, Sapphire Series teams as well. So it's doing a mix of both.